Hello everyone, welcome. This is Feline Intuition 1111. This is going to be a collective reading. We are going to look at your person's current feelings. So let's see. How is this person currently feeling about you? How are they feeling about you? Unexpected. Ooh. Change. Hmm. They could have seen something. We got liquid courage and roll the dice. This person. They could have seen something to do with you online. Some kind of change. Let me see. How does this person feel? There's a mixture of feelings here. Hold on. Twin flames. We got forever, my lady, eternal love, marriage, proposal, pregnancy, empress, reciprocity. We got real love, butterflies, heartfelt connection, relationship goals, power couple, marriage, stability, wishes granted, romance, no question, no doubt. And we have don't step out of character, trying new, pushing buttons, be the bigger person, zero to 100 real quick. There's a mixture here. I feel like for a lot of you, this person has a lot of love for you, but they could be triggered by something. How does this person currently feel about you? How do they feel about you currently? Eight of Swords. Oh my goodness. Could be a Capricorn for some of you. Gemini, Scorpio, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, energy. I'm seeing that this person, they're really stuck in their head about something. There is kind of obsessive energy here with the Page of Swords and the Devil, which means they they could be watching obsessively, which I did get with the unexpected card and change because it's like they see something or they saw something happen and they did not expect it this could be online it could be something that they heard but they seem to be stuck in their head about something this person's feeling like you've turned your back on them there is we do have the three of swords so they could be feeling heartbroken i do see somebody though trying to give you an offer we got two aces ace of cups ace of pentacles and the lovers why the eight of swords They feel like there's competition for you, for some of you, and that you're not taking any action. So this person could feel like you're not paying them any mind. You've turned your back on them, yet there's all this other competition. There's all these other people um, either trying to get your attention or you actually speak to someone else. Why the three of wands in reverse? moon this and you know this is hidden with the moon they could be hiding the fact that they're really upset about something and is clarifying the fact that you that you're no longer looking in their direction so they could be hiding the fact that they're very upset about this this is someone you had a breakup with or some kind of separation why the devil they're obsessed six of wands so you could be looking really good you could have taken back your energy, taken back your power, really shine in here. And this person is watching obsessively. That's why they saw something that they didn't like. Could be that they saw somebody flirting with you, heard that somebody was. They have a lot of emotion here. Queen of Cups. Why the Page of Swords? The Fool. They're attracted to you like very much physically as well. Like very much physically. They're, that, that's one of the main reasons why they can't take their eyes off of you. Okay, why the Ace of Pentacles? Yeah, this person, they feel like you have a boundary up, you have your guard up and you're not speaking to them, but they still want to make some type of offer. 
or speak to you for some with some kind of I don't know how they're gonna do it. I don't feel like they know what they wanna say. But we have two aces here. But they seem to be aware of um, your boundaries. Why the three of swords? We got the ace of swords in reverse. The emperor. This person feels, for some of you they could feel lied to. For others, they feel like they're losing at something. So again, with this competition energy, there being competition for you, or that's just how they perceive it, they feel like they're losing this competition, okay? There doesn't have to be even a competition going on. This is just the way they see it. Could be an Aries for some of you, Pisces. Why the Ace of Cups? Queen of Cups again. Some of you got more than one person um, with love offers for you. You could be the one juggling. You could be the one with a choice to make in love. If not now, then soon. Because uh, the Two of Pentacles, it was at the bottom of the deck. Now it's here. And there's two offers here and there's the lovers. So either... And this person was trying to choose between you and someone or you have two options that you'll be trying to choose between why the lovers yeah i feel like whoever is trying to choose is going to take their time queen of wands ten of swords someone's going to be hurt when when um a decision is made so if you're trying to make a decision you may end up like breaking someone's heart here be a Sagittarius let's look at your main spread and see how they're feeling they're definitely feeling obsessed and heartbroken so let's see whoa <laughs> How's this person feeling about you currently? How are they feeling about you? king of cups as they're feeling like their actual feelings for you right now the main feelings position this person is in love which goes with the real love and the twin flame i don't know what they did to be in this position where they are watching you but they have they have feelings they see you as they see you as still going for love like you could be dating despite any ending you had with them or they see you as you know not really giving up on love so they could be observing you obs <laughs> observing you explore options and look at this overall energy three of swords this person's heartbroken they're trying not to step out of character is what i feel i feel like with that moon that came out they're really trying to hide this why the nine of wands oh my goodness <laughs> three of swords is a theme here i feel like this person feels like they hurt you and they see you still like not giving up on love like i said with the nine of wands so they could be seeing you um date we've got seven of swords in reverse and they feel like you're no longer playing any, like you're no longer going to put up with any games from anyone. Why the King of Cups? The Emperor. I don't know if someone was against you or if there's people against you, but this person feels protective because of this queen of swords in reverse so this could be someone who maybe was talking about you 
but this is clarifying the king of cups and we have the ace of cups sorry not the ace the page of cups and the emperor again so this person, I don't know if someone is like talking bad about you to them or trying to get them to turn away from you, but they feel protective of you. Why the strength in reverse? They can feel like they don't, they don't, um, yeah, something about them feeling like they're not um, triumphant in this situation, like they're losing. And we have this king of pentacles. So there could be for some of you, another person in the picture who, who is stable. And this person feels like they're competing for you with that person. And that person is doing better than them. Stability wise. Or they just assume that or they assume you're dealing with someone who's very stable. Even if you're not. Because the king of pentacles. Why the page of pentacles in reverse? So this person is lazy and they want it to come off as if they're pushing you away i don't know why they feel like they're avoiding a, a disaster by doing so it could be to do with this person in their ear telling them not to come towards you three of pentacles queen of swords in reverse but they seem to be dragging their feet here and they have their guard up and they feel like, well, someone could be convincing them that they're avoiding a disaster by not coming towards you. But who is that person? Why the four of wands? Nine of swords in reverse. Temperance could be a Sagittarius for some of you. this person they sabotage themselves they have a fear of settling down being stable with someone they're taking their time here why why is the three of pentacles here why the three of pentacles they're asking people about coming towards you and i feel like people are giving them negative advice wheel of fortune in reverse They're going to start to pick up that whoever is giving them negative advice is jealous. Why the King of Pentacles? Moon in reverse. Some of you could be dealing with this King of Pentacles, or maybe it's just something they heard. Maybe someone is gossiping, telling them that someone is taking care of you financially. It could be a lie. It could be the truth. But they feel like there's a King of Pentacles in their way, male or female someone stable or financially stable could be dealing with the pisces for some of you taurus as well why the hangs man i feel like this person they may try to offer friendship first because i feel like they think they're going to be rejected or they think that you've moved on to me you have but I feel like someone's telling them this or maybe they they're watching your page why the death card the hangman again there's going to be some kind of transformation here because someone's seeing things differently again i feel like they could start to see someone as jealous of you because they keep talking negatively about you trying to turn them away from you could be a Scorpio for some of you, Pisces as well. The moon is coming out quite a bit, but now it's coming out in reverse. So whatever is, is hidden is coming to light for you to see. Why the moon in reverse? The star in reverse. I feel like you're gonna see this person's um pain like the things that they need to heal the reason why they were distant you may see some kind of like some insecurities in them that have been holding them back could be an aquarius for some of you how's this person feeling about you currently fantasy daydreaming imagining fantasize escaping avoiding blocking pushing away you see there's this lazy energy where this person is just kind of sitting in the fantasy 
of being with you, like just sitting on their feelings. How's this person feeling? Thinking, missing you, craving, desiring. This person is... They have feelings for you. The problem is, one, someone could be in their ear. Two, they are lazy, scared as well, and needing to heal. Got distance, separation, space, blockage. For a lot of you though, it could be that they're under the impression that you have moved on, which would bring even more fear. And they do feel like they're competing with someone who is, you know, better than them, I would say, in their mind, I guess. Or maybe they feel like they're competing with multiple people or they're just not feeling as confident. How's this person feeling about you? You made your bed now lay in it so i was getting that that some of you are kind of energetically pushing them away we got something shady is going on how's this person feeling about you unpredictable memories nostalgia they're stuck on their memories okay what's what's going on behind closed doors what is shady Some of you, they could feel like something shady is going on with you, like you're being a player, but for others of you, I feel for some, I feel for some of you, this person, they may date safe. They may have tried to find someone maybe less attractive, someone who wouldn't trigger their insecurities. What exactly is going on that's shady? Ace of Cups, Nine of Cups. This person could be very, it's like they have feelings for you, but they're not the best um, person. There's some laziness, there's some greed, them kind of wanting, I, I don't know if they like want to have you but not have to put in any effort or not have to be the one to make the move. We do have the Ace of Cups again. Let me see. How's this person feeling about you? How are they feeling about you currently? you are triggering my wounds i was saying that dysfunctional family childhood traumas abandonment for some of you they don't have the confidence to be with you and they could have friends like telling them you know that you'll you'll break their heart and this and that their friends could be insecure too we got our chapter is over finality no more cycles freedom how's this person feeling about you I want to gift you something special, unexpected, again, surprise, sentimental. So with that, hold on, I'm planning a surprise date for us. Fine dining, vacation, city getaway. With those cards saying that this person is trying to, like wants to take some kind of action, but the one with the chapter is over, this could be that a lot of you are Saying it's over between you and them. How does this person feel? Children, childlike, innocent, fun. True love, pure love, honest connection, career, business, success, achievements. Ice King, boss, entrepreneur, detached. This person could be really focusing on work to get their mind off of you, but I feel like they're also trying to act like they're detached. There is this emphasis on them trying to hide how they feel. 
yet they're talking to people about the situation trying to get advice but not really getting the best advice clarify don't step out of character please lovers <laughs> five of wands okay for some of you it's telling you that if you if this person comes towards you just stay calm and observe with this high priestess and the five of wands in reverse especially if you do have another option because it's like you kind of have the the say in the situation you can decide who you want to choose but It's like, okay, I'm getting that they don't want you to know the power that you have over them. Because this is someone, again, like I said, they have feelings for you, they have love for you, but they're not the best person. They still have things that they need to heal. So I'm seeing some tendencies with them where they don't want you to see that you have a lot of power over them right now. They want it to look like, you know, they're still, they're hard to get. They're unbothered. As, as I was saying that I was being drawn to this card, so keep this in mind when they're acting like they don't care. They want you to believe that. So I would say, since you've gotten this message, if they come towards you, don't really just kind of calmly observe them. Because you have more power than they want you to know that you have. But you know now, okay? now you know so you just kind of sit back and just listen to what they have to say and they will realize well they'll realize it won't be that easy to get in I'm not saying you should like tell them that you watch this reading and that you know but they'll know from your demeanor not to mess with you because i'm seeing it in the way they're seeing you that they can't play these games anymore that you are not ready to give up on love you are willing to find someone else some of you they may get the courage from liquid to do this to reach out or to come towards you but they're they're fronting they're trying to appear as if they have the power but i'm letting you know they don't especially if they're not your only option is what i'm seeing so What's the unexpected thing that's coming? What's the unexpected? Opening up of communication. Either that or there, some of you are planning to ignore them, which they're not expecting. But if there's been a lack of communication, it could pop up again. Like they could pop up on your phone. What's the change? The change is that they're bearing the burden now of the relationship and they're also not giving up and they are watching you page of swords clarify the real love card please page of swords again this person is watching two of pentacles seven of pentacles they're seeing that there's that you have options but for a lot of you, they're, they're indecisive. Some of you, this could be you being indecisive if you have options, trying to decide um, who is offering you the realest love here. Clear for the avoiding card. Eight of Pentacles in reverse. Yeah, nine of Pentacles. So I get this energy of this person um, trying to, they're trying to put in as low effort as possible because they're trying to maintain this power. I don't know if you did all the texting before, you were doing all the work, carrying the load of the relationship. They want that to continue. They want that, they want life easy, okay, with you. So, but the thing is, <laughs> you have the power and as long as you know that you could have them working for you and they know that that's why they don't want you to know because <laughs> they want to be you know 
the prize. But you can be the prize if you just trust that you do have the power here, especially if you are like more detached from them and if and even more if you have another option. Like if they're not the only person in the world to you, you have a lot more power than you think and they don't want you to know that. They are missing you, craving and desiring. Keep that in mind, okay? So this is what I'm seeing. They could be a Pisces, Aquarius, Sagittarius. Um, Pisces again. We had Gemini quite a bit. Taurus. Leo. And those are... Oh, Scorpio as well. So those are the main signs. I hope this was helpful. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.